as it's shown from combat simulations, Operate, Operation Hubertas. Hubertas. All right, we're going to play this from the access point of view, from the access side. So before we get started, please subscribe to my channel. It's free. And also leave comments and suggestions. And watch my videos and like them and share them. Helps me a lot. I promise you it does. A short scenario covering the last serious attempt of the Germans to take control of the remaining regions along the Volga River. November the 8th to November the 14th, medium number of units. This scenario covers the final German attack to gain control of Stalingrad from November the 8th to November the 14th, 1942, with a medium number of units on each side. Only the regions around the factories are in play. Each turn is equivalent to two days, victory by conquest or control of the factory regions along the Volga River at game end. Let's start him up. Okay, nice snowy region I see. Alright, we should read this. Uh, Mid-November, a seriously weakened 6th Army tries to extinguish the final pockets of Soviets. Once powerful divisions from each side from each side are, a mere, are mere shells of their former selves. With his, Hitler's approval, five battalions of the specialized engineers arrive to help finish the job. After two months of continuous close quarter fighting, the remnants of Choykov's army will wait for the final push by the Wehrmacht that will attempt to extinguish the Soviet foothold on the West Bank. Uh, copious amounts of artillery stand ready to support the defenders, while every remaining position has been turned into a fortress. Yes, Chukov remains and maintains a, ha a hand-picked group of naval infantry ready to counter-attack the Germans, while at the strategic level, mere days remain before the Red Army uh, unleashes Operation Uranus. Uh, catching the Germans unprepared and ultimately encircling the entire 8th Army at Stalingrad. As, as the German commander, your task is clear as to clear and, sec and secure the last regions along the Volga. A major feat if you succeed. Yeah. Alright, so we got him going. Let's get the cards going. Snow. Winter arrives early and uh, snow falls on the battlefield. Be, w be aware of lowest lower stacking limits in the snow, snow terrain, as well as sharp reduction of forage. Isolated troops will suffer more. From now on, units will suffer extra hits due to the low temperatures, frostbite, extreme cold, etc. Bad. It, just, it doesn't get worse, it gets bad. Yeah, we'll take that. Jeez. I mean, one. I'm just taking one. <laughs> I should have take, taken the Pioneers. Okay, we'll take those cards. Okay, so now's a good time to go through the... Uh, sorry, resume. I've got to... Yeah, I was in the right place. Sonori information. All right, let's see if these guys hold out with their Sonori information. So we read this, okay? The Axis player starts with very few valid troops, and they are rather under strength. Hopefully there is there are two reasons to capture. Yeah, there are two reasons to capture. His main assets are the Pioneer units. Soviet player has reasonable defenses, in, defenses initially and will receive the elite and naval troops as reinforcements. He will receive that. He can hope to build, uh, to hold, and uh, he can hope to hold good enough so to keep control of at least one factory at the end, uh, factory, as the enemy is quite weak. All right, well, <laughs> I didn't read that, but it's fine. Okay, he needs to control one factory. Uh, operation, uh, Hubertas scenario last three turns. November the 8th, turn 29 to November 14th, 1942. Each of the turn representing two days. So as Axis players moves first, it consists of the German Army and the German Air Forces. Soviets are the Red Army, Red Navy and Red Air Force. This just says, this is the zone of control thing. It basically means that if you capture a region, you need to leave a set of units, a force back, uh, like a garrison there for at least one turn. Otherwise, it, it turns back to the enemy player. Reverts. Okay, immediate victory. The Axis player wins if he controls all the factories at the end of any turn. Okay, fair enough. The Soviet, there's like three turns though. The Soviet player wins if he still controls one factory at the end of the scenario. Otherwise, the player with the most victory points wins the game. Uh, bonus or penalty VP each structure when captured provides one plus one bonus and losing the same uh, costs the former owner 
minus one victory point. By the end of the game, control of the regions adjacent to the Volga provides a plus two bonus for the controlling site. In addition, the following structures give the, give the, uh, the bonuses below. Initially, Soviet-controlled factories, Brickworks and Red October, 10 points. So, hmm, so we have to control, at any turn, if we control all the factories, we win. And he wins if he still controls at least one at the end of the scenario. So he mustn't control any. Oh, put the thing on. Let's have a look here. Jesus. Is, uh, okay, so there we go, the two. Okay, so this is not... Well, it is a factory, but if we look here... that Okay, so Red October and the Brickworks. But, yeah. And, of course, the Brickworks. Yeah, so these two. And then there are two points as well. This one is two points, uh, but the the laser ke chemical factory is not worth anything. Then it's just those two. So, but we doesn't mean that uh, doesn't mean that we can't control this. We need to control this, this, and this to win. And if he controls just one, he wins. Like if he controls this this region, this is a factory. I'm presuming he wins. All right, so we in shit. All right, let's let's just look at our forces. There's nothing there. There's nothing there. But not much. Okay, he's got a fair size force. He's got a fair size force. And he's got a fifth size force. So I, assume, I, I my plan of action is, okay? Of course, our forces are all on the side. We take this first. Take this. Uh, yeah, take this area, this region. And then move to there. And then take that. This, you do it one at a time. We can't take this. Well, it, it depends on what he's got in the for, in the in the in the. Uh, uh, I'm going to put one there because that's that's very important. We hold that rest. Okay, hang on. Uh, let me see something. How damaged? I I don't want. Let me just see something. Okay, he's pretty damaged, and he's pretty damaged. Ooh, these are the... See, it doesn't give you... You've got to be careful here, because it... Jeez, what's this? 100 jack. Okay, so we'll take that, and we'll fix those oaks over here. So let me see. I don't want to fix those others. Okay, yeah. This is 100 jack. Let me see if I got me in this side. See, it doesn't explain this. Oh, so 154. 154. I think it was this way. So, do you see what I'm saying? It's difficult to. It's that one. Okay. Uh, let's have a look here. This is the 1227. 1227. That's one. Okay, those two. We're not going to attack with those this turn. We might as well just give give them. And I want to put another uh, thing in there because we need to hold that. All right, that that's a. This is a. There's two points to, for him to get, so we need to hold that. We are three, and he is three. We want orders. Okay, so who are we gonna? Who are we gonna send? Okay, so we want. He's got a big force. He's got a big force. We've got to be careful of leaving us. Okay, so. First thing is that one. And because time's so limited, we might. And then we want. Let me just see how big that is. Uh, how big is this? They're in good condition. Okay, so we want... I'm going to... How much can they move? Oh, you can't move now. But uh, I'm just thinking of... Can they reach here? Do we have a... Oh, I'm just wondering...
he's gonna have to stay there i'm gonna i'm gonna ask him to get the power give me the power what's this the uh 305 359 79 14 and the 24th panel are ordered to attack the factories all units of these divisions receive plus one combat and moral assistance only for use on the factories and possibly support marker if possible <sighs> two points we you know what we're gonna go for it okay we're gonna go for it okay this is artillery fire artillery short we are gonna go for it okay we need to observe what's here big force big 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 force okay uh done we've now spent one uh okay i want to just what's oh sorry what's the big f well not too big okay and i want to another reconnaissance here i want to see what's in here not too bad and i want to see what this is okay it's just the defenses and forces okay so that's done let's let's bomb let's bomb let's bomb let's bomb sorry i'm up here now i've got to get used to that uh yeah we're going in big time we're gonna fly in there we're gonna take it out oh he's only got one there's a artillery shortage we'll throw it there is there any other artillery we can hoy nothing okay so let's start our fun okay unlocking orders winter winter sets in check the event log for details on further occurrences stop <laughs> this is stop effects train terrain turning the snow is uh, what this terrain turning white is snowy with uh, increased movement costs and worse combat condition all units uh, all units there <gasps> all right hang on he can he can go there okay so he can all right this guy's pretty damaged. These guys are pretty, pretty good. Oh, these guys are contact. I'm thinking these guys. Yes, it's bro. They're all pretty damaged. I think I'm going to. I'm going to go in with this. Right? Because he's. That's all those units are pretty good. I'm going to send this in. So we've got. Now 14 or 20 and uh, i wonder if i'll leave one behind i think i'm gonna leave well how many do i need how many have i got there i've got eight so i can't bring a eight that's two i can leave two behind okay so i'm gonna leave two what have i got i've got i'm gonna leave this one and this one and I'm going to leave it behind. Right, I'm going to put him there. He's going to sit in there. Right? And I'm sending... Oh, man. I'm sending him to there. So we're sitting now with 20. That's about... That's all we can do there. It's nothing else. We haven't got... Like, remember something. This is like... Okay, that's the brick factory. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna what is that oh that's a big factory sorry man i'm getting all confused yeah okay so we're gonna go to chemical works let's just see there. all right so that soviet's okay he's got six six bloody points already because we we get we offered up that no but we gave away those points man supposed to win this pack of cards yep i'm gonna play the cards yeah i'm gonna play it because we need it come on i put everything in there eh?
But this side is rotted. So we win. Oh, with, after all that stuff we put in there. Now the next turn is to get this over to here. Oh. Oh, air defense move. Okay. All right. Uh, take these out. These out. Let's go there. We're in here already. And we are there. I'm just checking where we all are. Because I don't want him to come out here and take over. Okay, so I'm going to keep... I'm going to put the air defense there. Because I want to keep this area. You understand? And I'm going to have to fight a... Um, I'm gonna have to fight these guys in the red uh, the the uh, red barracks. Do you have any artillery? Uh, no, nothing. Okay, so good. Let's go. So now we're getting attrition. Okay, so replacements. Jesus. Where is this? This is the Ordnance Fair, Barricade or Red Barracks or I don't know. It's brick Factory. Is that the Brick Factory? That is the Brick Factory. It's just, it's got the biggest amount in there. Or is it? Yeah, it's the Brick Factory. Okay, so we're going to need uh, four left. We're going to need to bolster these guys. Okay, so he needs... He needs... He needs... Um, he needs... Okay, so let's just put them in there. Alright, let's go. Soviet playing. Next is three one. We've got troops in there, thank God. Friendly civilians. Fire. Fight. 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 Quick battle. Okay. We have to be quick, guy, yeah, eh? And we're going to have to use all our orders. Look, look at that. We're going to have to use whatever orders we can use. Oh, okay. Card draw. Uh, oh, that's... Jeez. I hate that thing. Placements. Okay, we'll take that. Uh, you know what? We don't want that. We want these guys. That this is also good. It's also good, but we want those. Those is these. Well, I've got to. No, I don't want this one. I want that one. Go. Shit. Okay, so that's the card draw. We've got to come here next. Uh, yeah, we need to put one there. Wait, hang on a second. Yeah, we need to put one there. Okay. Reinforcements. Artillery shortage. What else can we play? Observers. He's got two here now. Okay, let's just... Uh, I think I'm much there, but maybe we need to somehow... Oh, shit. Um, 
Ja. Now we got to remember land movement. He's locked. We're going to have to. We're going to have to. There's no other choice. I mean, help me out here. I've got no cards to assault. We should assault that now. If we're not, ah, uh, we've got no. He's got two units there. He's got two in defense. He's got a. Uh, um, no, this is this is a suicide mission. There's nothing else we can do. Yeah. Have I got anything to shoot with? Nothing we can do. Yeah. Okay. So that's. It. There's nothing I can do. Yeah, friend. What do you want me to do? I can't come in here with the two units. He's got two, two units in there with, with um, strength. And if you look at the region, it's a minus one to the attacker and a two to defender. No, there's nothing that can move here. Those are the units you've given me to move. And I can't move any of these. And where are the rest of those I can move? So, no. Let's go. Uh, yeah, we want to, we want to clear that up because that's going to... We don't get any cards because we've got no bloody cards. Okay, so we win. Thank God for that. Okay. So that's the... So we can move all our units out of there now. This is a tough one. This is a tough one. Two, two, two victory points each. Okay, defense. Oh, these guys got to go out because they can't defend these. These. We don't need to defend this and this. We need to make sure this is defended. Very important to keep that at least that victory point on our side. Because this is a tough scenario, let me tell you. I don't think I'm going to win this. I mean, it's going to be... Well, I don't know. I won't say I don't know, but I don't think we're going to win this. Is there any artillery I can use? That That's it. There's no artillery on the German side yet. And there we go. We get winter. Shit. Um... We need the brick factory because if we're going to make a move, we're going to make one there. Yeah, oh, we that's we need this thing healthy, 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 very healthy. So that's it. We need the brick factory healthy because we're going to come in here next. Uh, okay. He can go up there, that doesn't matter. If he weakens his forces by going up there, it's better. If he, you know, yeah, where he's attacking. He can go attack at there, there's no points there. Wait. Well, he might cut us off, but... Uh. <laughs> we got to worry about that, that's actually true. Oh, fuck it. But that's okay. What we'll do... What we'll do is that we'll cut into here. 
if we can. Okay, three orders. We need it. That we need. Uh, I'll, I'll put over there. Yeah, I think we're out of supply. Yeah. Oh, that's our unit. Are we out of do does okay? It's not counting as out of supply because this area is within supply. Okay, so it's not so luckily. First order. Um, there. We need this activated. Second order. Oh, he's got shit. Oh, shit. We need that activated. Fuck it, yeah. Why was that thing there? I thought I'd put... Unless I got reinforcements, I thought I'd put that whole group in here. Didn't we attack here and take that from him? Or was it this one? We need this force. Yeah. No, no, we need that. That's not a... That's not even a... I'm going to activate that. Those are two big forces. How did this force got down here? Okay. Alright, artillery bomb. There we go. Boom. Oh, we can't. We can only put three there. Alright, so... I need that. Okay, so... That's going to go in there. That's gonna go in there, and that's all the artillery we got. Uh, yeah. But hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Hang on. Yeah, that's gonna go in. Oh, he can't. He can only. So, how many? How many is he? He's got five, and we've got nineteen. So we need to make it up. We need to take these pioneers. And let's see, we've got some more pioneers here. We need to take that. These are these are pioneers. We need pioneers. I'm just gonna take let me just skip those ones. Wait, hang on. Great, we can reach. Okay, so we are now sitting at 10. Alright. We need to bring some O's in here to guard there. I will leave some O's back here at the brickworks. Uh, Pioneer. Just trying to take the biggest stacks that we got. Um, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I've got, got that. Uh, yeah. Okay, so let's just split this off. I know I'm doing this in pieces, but I... Okay, so we are now at 15. We need five more. Yeah. Yeah. Hmm. That's a pioneer, but he's pretty depleted, man. I'll take him and him. So it's one, two, one, one, two, three, four, and five. Will that fit? Perfect. Now he's got one of those and one of these. must go to this area here so we need to keep two back here and then this lot over there okay so that's done uh shit we know what he's got here it's two so 
31. This is the last turn. So we've got to... In we go. And there's nothing or there's no there's not even a card we can draw. So we've got everything. We've let everything. There's a big force over there. I mean see oh, over here, there's twenty in here. Let's hope we can get it. And then there's we just left some rubble behind here. But we just taking a chance. There's nothing we can move. And there's no more cards left. So we're not gonna win this fight. That's for sure. Uh where's our Tasha Woods? Let's just just, just do that our Tasha Woods there, eh? just to get it over with. He's only got two. I'm not going to fight him. No, I'm going to save that. I'm going to save it. Okay. Now, this is the chemical factory. I'm also going to save some of my... Well, I'm going to might use one attacker card. Close air support. Sixteen percent. No, I'm not gonna Let's see something. The eighty-four. I'm not gonna use that. I want to keep that card for. Yeah, we're not gonna win that. Okay, this is the card. This is what I want to keep the one card for. We didn't get that card. We don't get that card, yeah. Okay, we do. Assault. Got to beat this guy. Come on, fight. Send everything in here. Come on. Okay. Did we win? You see now, you see there, he's got the minus one. And we got the three. And he won that fight. He was ran away, it disrupted. He ran away, he routed. His troops routed. He's got the minus one, which is his morale and ours is three. Yet he still won the battle. Something's ganked with the with the with the calculations here. I promise you. So we've lost this. Uh Oh, where am I going to put the air flares? All right, let's just take. So we've lost that. We've lost that fight. Um, I'll put it over there because we need to keep this region at least. Uh, there's nothing else. Something's ganked with the combat. And I've looked on the on the internet. I've looked at that while they just and I couldn't find anything to 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 explain that. Explain that up with he's got minus one morale and he's been routed the, the thing came up said Soviets were routed and he's got one minus one morale And we've got three and yet he still wins the fight With all our forces and he's hardly got anything left something's ganked Uh, that was two, eh? It was one on one. Oh, we got nothing left. Okay, good. Yeah, that's it. That's the end of the turn. He's playing for the last turn now. And we don't get any more orders moves. Okay, that's finished. That's a pretty quick battle. Yeah, I see. I'm telling you that something's ganked there. 
We've got all this control. We didn't win this fight. Soviets won it. What was the score? Okay, 15. It's a, it's a Farag. He won us 30, 33%. Is that victory? Why do we have 25 Soviet victory minus 33% Farag and 15% and he's... Soviets win by keeping control. Yeah, there we go. So that, that scenario, that scenario description actually worked here. Soviets win by keeping control of at least one fact, one, at least one of the factory regions. And that's what he did. And that, that thing worked. That's why it doesn't matter what his score was. He kept it. And he wins a strategic victory. It's minus 33%. I don't know what that is for Reich. Because we got 25%. Let's just go back in there. Yeah, you see, we we got 25 and he had 15. We actually won the 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 the, the a bit confused by that score. We won because we've got more. You see, we've got more control. We've got this region. We've got this 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 region. These are all victory points. And the and the the factories are worth five. So we get and these factories are worth. Well, I think they were worth ten, weren't they? Was it the brick one? Okay, so that's two. Oh, those weren't ten. Those weren't ten. Which ones were ten? Oh, that one was ten. That one was, wasn't this one ten. Oh, it doesn't matter. There were two. There were, there were two factories. I think that were with ten there. Where's the scenario description? Where is it now? So we factor brickworks and the and the red October. So those two were worth 10, right? Well, where's the Red October? I think this is the Red October, yeah. Red October, and then the Brickworks, which is this. This is supposed to be worth 10, but it doesn't add up there. Okay, so he had the 110, and we had the 110. So we won on points, but he, he can, he, at least he controls at least one factory. At the end of the turn. So he did win. He won a Farai victory. Minus 33%. Tough scenario. Really tough. That's probably what, how this was. Because I remember in Stalingrad. Uh, the Germans got right up to this. They squeezed them right into a corner here. Right into a little. By the factories. Right into little corners here. There were only some outcrops. Outbits here and there. And they squeezed them in there. And this is sort of. And then Operation Uranus kicked off. Well yeah. With the Soviets then encircling the the sixth army but it was like this and uh yeah it's tough to tough to, to to win all of these in three turns is very tough because i mean you saw me yeah? i i put all my i put all my power in yeah and he would have still won because this is a factory as well this laser fair chemical factory this is a chemical works i'm sure that's also a factory so he was still one you understand so we put everything in here. We gained this region. We took this away and we put everything in there. And I'm telling you now that combat is janked. You saw yourself. He had a minus one. We had positive morale. He had mi minus one mor morale. He had only like two p units there and they were almost depleted. He routed and then the Soviets still won. And I've looked in the, the rules and that and there's no explanation for that sort of outcome. So I'm telling you this thing is ganked. But the good news is ganked on my side too. So sometimes I win when I shouldn't win. So it kind of evens itself out. But it's still ganked. All right. Yeah, I love this game. Re really good. We tried our best, but we lost this one. Sean from... Uh, um, next time I'm going to play as the Soviets and see if I can win this scenario as a Soviets. Sean from Combat Simulations. Please subscribe to my channel. It's free. And also leave comments and suggestions. And watch my videos and like them and share them. Helps me a lot. I promise you. Until our next uh, video as a so as a Soviets for for this uh, scenario. Good day on you.